when you're meditating, you're, look after, you're looking after your inner treasures. We all have treasures outside, our wealth, our body. But these are things that can leave us at any time. And look at the body. It's something that's just made to decay. When we first got it, we thought this was great. It was getting bigger and stronger all the time. We could do things we couldn't do before. But then it reached its limit, and then it just turned around, and it's leaving us bit by bit by bit. It's like having a big cube of ice in your house. If you try to keep it from melting, you put all sorts of things around it to protect it, but sometimes that actually makes it melt faster. What you've got to do is figure out, okay, what are the things that have real value that have to be kept cool? Okay, you keep those cool. And then when the, when the ice is melted, okay, that's okay, because you still have the other things that you need. In other words, you use the body in order to give rise to happiness, a genuine kind of happiness in the mind. You use it to be generous. You use it to observe the precepts. You use it to meditate. Okay, that's getting good use out of it while you've got it. And then when it's finally melted away, okay, that's the end of that. But you've gotten good use out of it. Because it's the qualities of the mind. Those are your real treasure. They don't have to disintegrate the same way the body does. They don't have to decay the same way the body does. You have to look after them, though. If you just kind of let them be, they, they begin to melt away as well. So you have to keep looking after them every day, every day, every day. And to finally you dig down inside and find something that's really of value in, inside the mind, which doesn't change, which doesn't disintegrate. Once you've got that, okay, then you're safe for life, safe forever. But in the meantime, you've got to look after what you, all the good things you've got in the mind so that you can find that thing of real value inside. So make sure that that's your top priority. We look after the body, we look after our material things, because they do have their uses. But you remember, it's like, it's like the spoon in a curry. You put the spoon in your mouth, not because you're going to eat the spoon, it's because you want to bring, bring the curry into the mouth. And the same way with, a, with your body. Okay? You, you can't take the body with you, but you can use it to develop good qualities in the mind. And so make sure the, the good qualities in your mind, those are your main concern. Because the time comes when you have to put the spoon down, but you've got the nourishment from the curry, and that's what you want. So always keep this point in mind as to where your real priorities are, what's really of value in your life, and what's of temporary value. So you can get the most out of both the things that are temporary and the things that are lasting. <laughs>